I'm afraid. I promise I will verbally say whoa if you need to whoa. <laughs> Not wanting to see too many loops in there because that's where your feet can disappear. It'd be in front of my horse to start with. I say thank you, especially for a horse this kind of standing still. A weight to move into the shoulder, so I like an invitation for a head to be still. Come into the shoulder. Two hands on my horse. Got my line here, you can run from my hand, but I'm getting not to be interfering with that head. You can hear where the good mutual brilliance takes place, but also where some crazy people jump and bite. Two hands on your horse. I'm going to move over to the withers and down around where the cinch is going to go. This is going to be a good indication of how my horse is going to behave with the saddle. All the time, I'd like that head to either be straight or sliding towards me. Staying in nice and close, again, two hands on the horse. I can let my hand move all the way back to the back end. I can come under here into the stomach. This is where dogs and bears would rip out the intestines. So the glass is being kind enough to let me into all these areas. So it's four um, bringing everything together. So not one at a time, all of it together, making sure those shoulders stay at the saddle area, not in front. And once he goes, let him go. So there's no conflict in the messenger forward and then stop. So once you get that beautiful trot, measuring lucky stride there to determine the length of the right front and the left front etc both at a walk and a trot times body length and that's in the crease of the shoulder that's cool spook busting started early he's not been settled Danielle and Ursa are measuring Lily's stride at the trot. Adam's looking for Lucky's pulse there. Okay. And now I need the damn timer. <laughs> Good job, Dana. Okay, so now I'm going to do <coughs> two. And you don't want him clamping down on any of it because if he gets scared, he'd run off with the parachute in his mouth.
just going to... Georgia really doesn't care about much, although she hasn't had a rider on yet. She's enjoying this, this little desensitizing party. That's it. Just know some horses don't like to see horses with sheets on. A little far out. There, feel that? There's your angle, okay? So now, this is Farrier Prep for Onyx. He doesn't like the Farrier, so he's actually in class four kicking. So this is preparing him better so the Farrier doesn't have to train. So we're looking for him to yield and give and relax with this. There you go. the Mustangs, also known as the Indian Pony Horses. They're about eight years of age, maybe ten years, but eight years in captivity with very little done. So this is week two when we're doing the obstacle course with them. Um, we're looking for adoptions. So these guys have brands and um, they're trying pretty hard right now. Oh, okay. <laughs> guy we could actually only get a hold on today after six days so he's doing beautifully. I met on YouTube I was so laughed to death. Oh yes, okay. Well now watch this is a surprise. <laughs> <laughs>